Hello people, my name is Ferdy and in this tutorial I will show you how to deal with incoming orders on your WooCommerce website. We'll talk about handling incoming orders and how to adjust the order confirmation emails your buyers will get. If you want to learn from start to finish how to create a complete webshop using WordPress and WooCommerce, then watch this tutorial. Now let's get started. I choose cash on delivery. I read and agree to the website terms and conditions and I click on place the order. Thank you, your order has been received. We see the order number, we see the date, the total amount, the email, the payment method, and what we have bought. And now I get an email with the confirmation for myself as a website owner that I have a new order over here from buy the Xbox Series X or PlayStation 5 in stock. Thank you for your order in purple. Hey Ferdy, just let you know we received your order with the number and then more details over here. This is the message I gave when people buy the Nike hoodie. They can see it over here. The subtotal, subtotal the shipping, the VAT, payment methods, and the total amount they have to pay. And then over here it says, thank you for using game consoles and build with WooCommerce. So we can adjust a lot of things. And it's from the email, by the way, in fairdecorpsook at Gmail. So this is the email I get because I bought this product. If I would go to my Gmail account, I see the email from Ick, which means me. New order. You received an order from Ferdy Corpsuk. So th this is what I receive as the administrator. So I need to send this product three times to this address or to this address. Awesome. So how can I change all this stuff? Because I think it can look better. This is totally not in the style of our website. So let me do that. I go to the customizer. Why? I want to grab the color blue. So I go to the colors. I grab this color. I copy the color and I close this. Now I go to the back end to WooCommerce settings and I go to emails. These are all the emails that will be sent on different occasions. So when there's a new order, I as the administrator will receive email about a new order. Or when an order is canceled, I will receive an email. Or when an order is filled, I will receive an email. And the customers receive all those emails depending on how they order something. So if I take a look uh, to the email I got, pay with cash upon delivery, your order is being processed. So I got this email and we can adjust that email. But first we can scroll down and change the from name because because right now this is the from name and this is the email address. So let's change that. I prefer to say game consoles. And then the from address is info at game, game consoles.com. We can have a header image. Let's talk about it in a minute. Right now I want to change the base color to blue. The body text to 222222. Two, 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 two. I save it, then I go to the media and I search for the logo. This one, it's quite wide, so I copy this to the clipboard. I download it to my desktop and I want to upload it again. There it is, but this time I want to edit the image make it smaller. Let's say 300. I click on skill and that's it. What I want to do, I want to close this, go to that image again, copy the file, the URL to the clipboard. Then I go back to WooCommerce settings to emails. And now over here at the header image, I can place this link. Then there's the footer text built with WooCommerce. I don't need that. I just want to show the site title or good luck with your game, whatever. So this looks better already. So now I want to do a new order. I buy this t-shirt, black version, add it to the cart. View the card, proceed to the checkout, and 
I place the order. So now I get a new email. But this time, it is not from by the Xbox, it's from game consoles. If I click over here, it's from info at gameconsoles.com, which looks in my opinion better than this one. Awesome. Thank you for your order and look at the difference. Now there's my logo over here. Thank you for your order. The color is changed and this text is different. But wait, we can do more because we know this is the processing email. So if I go to that email again, WooCommerce, settings, emails, and if I go to processing order, it says your site title order has been received. And that is what we see. Your by the Xbox series order has been received. I would prefer to say your, your order has been received. Additional content, thanks for using, and then the site URL, that's something you see over here. Thanks for using the website. So I can also say, good luck with your product. If you have any question, feel free to reach out to us. Save it. So now again, if I order something, view the card, proceed to the checkout, place the order, and I go to my email. Now it says your order has been received instead of your buy the Xbox blah 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 order has been received. Since I bought the, the coaching call, it says go to this link to book an appointment with me. And it says good luck with your products. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. So step by step, we can make it look better. You can take it to the next step. It's up to you to do that. How can you do that? One more thing, I go to WooCommerce, settings, emails. I can go to the processing order, click on manage. And then I can say copy the file to the theme. That's what I will do. And I save the changes. Now I go to the appearance theme file editor. So we're going to take a look at the code. Be careful with that. Don't mess things up. Then I scroll down. I go to WooCommerce, emails, customer processing order. And now I can change things over here. So what I see in the email is just to let you know, if I want to change that text, I scroll down and I search for the text just to let you know, receive your order. So I can also say, thank you for your order. Your order number is, and this one is order number code. We will let you know when your order is processed and on your, and on its way to you. Update. Awesome. So now again, we order something. Proceed to the checkout, place the order. So now we will see that the text over here is changed. There we go. You see, thank you for your order, your order number is, we will let you know when your order is processed and on its way to you. Okay. When the order is received, we see over here at WooCommerce orders that there's a new order and that's being processed. So if I click over here and what I will do, I'll go to my living room where all my playstations are <laughs> and all my products. I will pack it. I will go to the post office and I will send it to this address. Then I come back to my computer and I change the status to complete it. I click on update. When I do that, this person gets an email over here. 
Thank you for shopping with us. Hey Ferdy, we have finished processing your order. Pay with cash upon delivery. So instead, by now you should know if you go to the settings and to emails and to completed order, I can copy the, this, the file to the theme. Save the changes. Go to appearance, theme file editor, WooCommerce, emails, customer completed. I can say good news. We packed your order and it is on its way to you. Update. I don't have to test this, but then it would say, Hey, we've uh, completed your order and it's on its way to you. So in that way you can change the colors. You can add your logo, change the name over here, change the email address and change all the information. And that's how you can make it better. Thank you for watching this video. I hope it was helpful for you. If you want to learn how to create a complete WordPress website from start to finish, then watch this tutorial. It will appear somewhere over here. And if you want to subscribe, it will also appear somewhere over here. You can do that for more upcoming WordPress, WooCommerce, affiliate marketing, and e-commerce, but the same as WooCommerce related tutorials. Okay. Bye-bye.